<clears throat> ah, excuse me. Welcome back to Hodgepodge. Today we are talking about Spark. Spark produces vitamin air as a recreational inhalation device enriched by earth and tested by science. Our quintessential blend is infused with the finest quality vitamins and herbs found in nature. Nicotine and other harmful chemicals commonly found in inhalation products have been omitted. This is a guilt-free inhalation experience. So, I've got a lot of positive things to say about this. I've got a few negative things to say about this. So I'd appreciate it if you stayed to the end of the video. So, here's the box. It fits four. They come in these, what I would call, roly-poly sort of boxes. So they have these rubber caps that it comes in. You can find it in this box. And then this just, and it magnets closed when it's not a tight fit. Just magnets. Kind of neat. Neat packaging. It's got the picture of the product on there. There are a few different options that you can choose from. There are uh, melt, fuel, and pure. Pure is uh, not one that I chose, but they also have flavors such as strawberry and vanilla. I gotta say the vanilla was much better with coffee. The strawberry was very sweet. It tasted a lot like a candy or milkshake. I gotta say the design is pretty freaking sweet. This is uh, metal, real metal. It's not plastic coated with anything to look like metal. And uh, this thing, this thing's hard, man. Hardcore. I mean, I could put a dent in this table with this. So uh, it is heavy. It has like a quality sort of feel to it. And then this is actual wood. And then we have some inlay on the top here. And the inlay changes colors for the different flavors. Now... The neat thing about this being metal and wood is that you can actually recycle these or upcycle them, reuse them. And so once you are finished with them, you put them in this package, send them in the mail, and then they can uh, recharge and repurpose these vapes. So what happened is I was smoking and smoking this um, the substance and I noticed there was like a bit of buildup on the top of this inlay and then I went to wipe it and it was completely brown like uh, tobacco or scab I'm thinking this is no different from cigarettes it's no different from you know smoking a normal cigarette and the other thing is these didn't last me more than a day <clears throat> I don't know if the pod emptied or if the battery went out but uh, you know, that's that's another negative thing that I would say is that I don't know how much juice is in here. I don't know if I've used up all the juice. Uh, there's no battery meter, so there's no way to tell when the battery is getting low. There is no way to recharge them. You simply run them out and then send them back in to be recharged and refilled. So I don't know how much of the juice I smoked. I don't know if it came with a full battery. There was no way of knowing. We'll just, we'll just drag through this. All right, there you see. A brown dot. That was from this vaporizer. Let's try again. Another brown dot. Kind of gross, right? A little concerning. You can see it from the top. Brown. Okay. So you get it. I don't know what kind of damage this is doing to my lungs. And uh, see, that's the thing. is The claims these guys are making are right here on the box in the package. And I'll read them off to you. We ensure all products are formulated under the direction of of a renowned inhalation toxicologist and tested 
by an independent FDA approved laboratory. So in all of them you see this alkaline and organic vegetable glycerin and you wonder if that's what makes up the liquid that uh, is then vaporized and uh, you wonder if it's the the vegetable glycerin that's turning brown or the the alkaline charred from being burnt inside there or or what what's making this brown that's what I'd like to know whether this brown is safe okay vitamin air is a recreational inhalation device FDA has not evaluated the safety of this product or any of the statements made by the manufacturer okay here we go so the FDA has not evaluated the safety of this product or any of the statements made by the manufacturer on behalf of this product. So they kind of fool you by saying on the box they say tested by an independent FDA approved laboratory. Now they they are independent so they are not associated with FDA and uh, again the FDA has not it says on the product the FDA has not evaluated the safety of this product or any of the statements made by the manufacturer on behalf of the product. I bought this because I wanted to quit the Juul. I wanted to quit vaping nicotine. And these looked like uh, a better option, a safer option. I've, I've seen the videos of cigarettes in, in a bottle pulled through with with air they put a bunch of cotton balls in a coke bottle and they they just run a vacuum for hours on end feeding it cigarettes and the the cotton balls turn brown they've done the same thing with the jewel now when they not turn brown you know we we humans are very dependent upon visuals and sights now just because it's not brown doesn't mean it's safer you can see when they do it with a jewel that the lung stays clean but the thing that scares me about these is that when you're pulling the air out of here as I showed you with the tissue is that the um, the air is not clean it's not it's not pure it's it's brown it's coming out brown not happy with how long these lasted not happy with the fact that I can't see what's in the pod not happy with the fact that I don't know how much battery or that I can't recharge it these have to be sent in you know, you could hang on to these. These are 20 bucks a piece, by the way. So this is 60 bucks right here. Then these have to be sent back in. You know, I care about the environment, but, you know, if I have to run to the post office every time I want to get rid of these things, that's dedication. All right, so the other thing is that these really don't toke well at all. If you were to get a full seal around the end and suck in, it's kind of like uh, breathing through a straw. And I mean a small straw, like a coffee mixer straw. That hole is very tiny. And it just pulls out of these these four tiny slits at the bottom. And it's it's kind of like you get out of breath. When you do toke, you're taking in air as well. And that's another thing is this this does toke fairly warm. So you want to take in air. That kind of inhibits the experience. A lot of people just want a, a full toke, wide toke, a cool toke. Um, that other vaporizers might provide you with that's not this you're getting air with this it can be thick though if you if you can take the warm the warmness like I'm saying I feel out of breath Whew. from because uh, it's it's like breathing through a straw I mean I felt like I had to take in air with that Alright, there you have it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. 
check out my other videos, and subscribe.